given that the total length of the beam is 20 meters so each will be 5 meters span 5 meter 5 meter and 5 meter since it is a symmetrical beam we can uh, know from that reactions is 5 and 5 kilonewton let us draw the bending moment diagram moment here will be 5 into reaction 5 into 10 which is 50 kilonewton meter and the hogging so positive and at this at 5 meters from here it will be 25 let us draw the curvature diagram now till here it is EI so this will be total will be 25 by EI it is 25 by EI from here it changed to 2 EI so the uh, here it will be 12.5 so from 12.5 to again 50 by e, 2 EI will be 25 by EI. So this changes like this. And again from here it will be like this. So this is again 25 by EI. But this is 12.5 by EI. This is curvature diagram which becomes the loading diagram for a conjugate beam. So the load is 25 by EI, 12.5 and 25 by EI. And here it is again 12.5 by EI and the total is 25 by EI. Let us calculate the reactions RA and RB for this conjugate beam. Since it, since it is symmetrical, RA will be equal to RB that equal to half of the total load. So that will be half of triangular portion half base will be 5 meters and this is 5 meters and this is 5 meters and this is 5 meters half base is 5 into height is 25 by EI it is uh, 2 triangles so taken twice plus 12.5 by EI into 10 is the rectangular portion plus upper triangle is half base is 10 into height is 12.5 by EI on simplifying it becomes 156.25 by EI so the reaction here is 156.25 by EI and RB is also equal to 156.25 by EI. Mid span deflection it is asked. Mid span deflection means deflection at C. Say let it, this is C. Deflection at C is equal to bending moment at C of curvature diagram or of conjugate beam. So it implies bending moment will be RA into 10 that is 156.25 by EI into 10 minus half triangular area 5 into 25 by EI into CG distances 5 plus 1 third of 5. And the rectangular area will be 12.5 by EI into 5 into CG distance will be 5 by 2. And the next triangular area, upper triangular area will be half. Base is 5 into 12.5 by EI into CG distance will be 1 third of 5. 
So on simplifying, we obtain delta at C to be 1, deflection at C to be 1875 by 2 EI, that is 937.5 by EI.